Steve, uh, obviously a disappointing afternoon for us all. Embarrassing afternoon, Jim. Um, in control, first half, second half, uh, same old story, give them two goals. Um, they, they pushed us on the ascendancy um, by changing their system. All we need to do is track runners and be braver in our box, and we won. That's why I've spent 40 odd minutes in there with them now. Mm -hmm. I put four seven days in for players last week. Um, I had one in for one. Sorry, could you just repeat that? Sorry. I put four seven days in for players last week. Yeah, yeah. Um, I had one in for mine. We spoke to another club and wanted to stay in um, because they ain't good enough. Mm -hmm. uh, the football, all that's nice, pretty. It's not not helping us. You know, we're in control of that game at half time. A bit of a rant at the minute, but I'm fuming because we're out of a cup we shouldn't be out of. Um, but individual errors have cost us again, which it has done all season. So it's my responsibility to change it. But as I said to them in there, it can't be done overnight. You have to wait, you have to bide your time. Mm -hmm. um, but it will happen um, because I'm not accepting that. Not just today, it's been a build up of stuff. And when you're in control of a game today and, and then you capitulate like that at the end and you see the urgency to try and get back into it, there weren't none there. Mm, mm. Put me through centre halves up, one flicked it on the other centre half trying to get him behind. No one else nowhere near him. Mm, um, mm, mm. Too many players uh, are Bostic Premier um, mentality and you get found out at this level massively and we are every single game. To be honest, you may disagree but I'm sure supporters would agree with me, we didn't really look like actually scoring a goal. Second half anyway. No, because they didn't do what we wanted to do. They didn't pass the ball. They didn't get in between players. Um, we decided to run at players. They're an athletic side. We decided to run against full backs, try and take them on. Got the ball dispossessed. They're up the other end, it's in the back of the net. Um, so, yeah, we didn't. We didn't create much second half. Well, we didn't create anything second half. Um, and that's, that's poor. That's poor at home in the FA Cup. Um, we didn't have the game plan to sit in there in the second half. We planned to do exactly the same as we did in the first half, which I don't think they had a shot in the first half. No, Let's no. get it right. I think no, no, they were very poor, they, I thought, I, in the I, first half. I think they've had, they've had two shots, maybe three shots all game. Mm. We've had the penalty and maybe Rudy's had a shot. Mm. So it's, it's, it's a game of no shots. Mm. But we've given two goals again. Mm. You know, and it's, it's switching off at vital times, and that's put us out of the cup, and I'm fuming with that. Overall, it. I've got to say, it wasn't a great game on overall quality. Uh, I couldn't give it too many marks today. Um, but, you know, you still have to win those games. Of course you do. You have to be resolute. You have to be ugly. You have to be horrible. If I had 11 six foot one players out there today, you wouldn't have seen nice football, but you would have seen a win because they would have got their body in the way, they would have stuck their head where it hurts, and some of them players are too nice. And don't be... Uh, some of them won't be involved next week in terms of the starting lineup, and I'll tell you that now. Um, and they've got to earn their right to get back in the side because that's nowhere near good enough today. That's, that's let the club down, that's let the staff down, and they've let themselves down. Um, and that's not me taking nothing away from Eastbourne because they've come here and they've got their win, so I can't be disrespectful to them. Um, but I look at my side rather than other sides, and you've got to do what's best for you. And today, say, the, the two goals are criminal. One sort of bright part of the game, and he's only here for a month. Uh, many of us, uh, including me, thought that um, thought that uh, Jack Rodney did pretty yeah. well today for his first for his first start. Probably hasn't played much sort of football at this level. Oh, he hasn't. Thing. He hasn't played no football at this level. Mm -hmm. uh, he's been around the first team. Mm -hmm. They want him to get him out and get some games. And um, well, first half he done ever so well. Second half where we didn't pass the ball, he was bypassed mm -hmm. and he ran out of steam. That's why he came yeah. off. That's his first proper game yeah, really. So he's. Um, he done really well. Good, good, bright spark for us. Um, impressed with what he done. But he needed the other ones to stand up and be counted. And uh, yeah. there was at least a half a dozen out there that shone away from the actual determination and desire you need to win a game of football, especially in the FA Cup. One or two absentees. Uh, Tommy Heston Harris is not round about. No, he's not right. He's still got shingles. Okay. Um, he had shingles, so he's. He's uh, off medication now, he finished his last bit of medication, but he's, um, he should be back in the next week or two maybe, I'm hoping, but again it's, it's something you can't miss about with that. And uh, Tommy Brewer? He's, he's sort of Ankle injured. still sore, okay. Ankle still okay. sore. so we'll hopefully work with him this week and he'll be back next Saturday um, to, to strengthen us because you need players like that, 
um, in your side that demand a lot from others and uh, we were found wanting in certain areas. There were certain players that done it today. You know, I thought Chin done well when he when he started up there on his own, he worked hard and had some good link up play. But again it's one of those we, we Cow done really well. Um, mm -hmm. but we didn't do a lot of scoring. As you said, a few oohs and ahs with a couple of crosses that got cut out. Um, but we're playing a team that's at our level that it was the only all national south side um, mm -hmm. tie. Mm -hmm. The way we started, I thought we had the opportunity to win it. Got, mm -hmm. got the penalty and scored. Um, but then we just capitulated. And that's nothing, that's nothing. I, I will always take the blame for certain things, but not today. Mm -hmm. I, I've, I've told them in there, not hanging them out of dry, but I'm telling it as it is. You know, mm -hmm. I get things wrong, I roll my hands up. Our system didn't change from first half to second half, and we were in control. Their system changed, and our players were at a, lot, a loss, mm -hmm. even though they do the same job. They didn't have to do no different jobs. Mm -hmm. um, and they let themselves down today, and I'm, I'm bitterly disappointed for the club not to get through. Um, and I'm more disappointed with their second half performance. Seems like we only played half a game now. Mm, uh, and yeah. At this level, you can't do that. <coughs> can't do that. Um, and I take it Aid has gone back to to Dulwich. He has. Yeah, his loan was up today. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, they didn't put him Did, in for the FA yeah. Cup, so he's gone back. Mm -hmm. um, and he done well for us, but yeah, like yeah, I say, we've got to look at other we're, avenues now. We could have done with him there today. <laughs> well, perhaps. That's perhaps. Not, yeah, but that's nothing away from, from what our boys done no, right. no, 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 that's, that's not a direct criticism of yeah. the strikers particularly. No, the boys done right. What, what happened is, if you look at the, the nuts and bolts of it, it's the decisions that, am I going to get my head kicked off and, mm. and stop a goal going in? Am I going to make sure I'm in the right position to stop balls being played through us? Which in the first half we was. Mm. They didn't have a shot in the first half. Mm. Mm. They didn't have a shot. So we've done something right. Um, and if you do that for the second half, like you say, it's an ugly game, but you win it mm. and you get through to the next round. Yeah, yeah. But we haven't got the mentality to do that at the minute. And my job is to change it, but it's not. It's not even about the money side of it. It's just very hard to get players in at this moment. Of course. Excuse me. Yeah. To get yeah. players in at this moment in time because what we we're only in the middle of September. Mm. So six weeks into the season, seven weeks into the season, um, players will become available. Mm. Um, it seems like we've been going for ages. Really, really. It does, it does. <laughs> but there you, you play, well, we don't, we have a Saturday off now because we're not in the FA Cup, mm, which, is, mm. which is not very good. And I'm not mm. pleased with it and I won't be pleased with it. It's going to take a long time to get over because as much as we thought, like I say, it was the toughest game in, in the draw on the pyramid, it, it was. Mm. But I thought first off we was in control. Yeah. If we'd only managed that in the second half, yeah. Um, oh, they'd definitely. be sitting here happy getting through to the next round. Oh, um, but no, nah, not good enough, mate. Nowhere near. So, uh, it'd be wrong for me to say, but I will say, a relegation battle next Saturday. Uh, certainly to say that at this stage of the season. But obviously Hampton are right down there as, along with us, so it's going well, to be, it it's, it's they, be a big game. If they it? beat us, we go down to the bottom. Yeah, it's going um, to be a big game. You can't, you've got to look at it, and you've got to be fearful of it. Um, but you look at the other side, we're six points off Dulwich and Nick are 14th. Mm, yeah. So, it's still very close. It's buts and maybes. Yeah. It's what happens on the pitch. And if we continue like that, we are going to be in a relegation battle. And we're 99% sure we'll be relegated mm. because we're not learning at the minute, Jim. Mm. Um, we educate them, we try and help them. But when they go over the white line, they're the ones that have got to do it. Otherwise, I've got to change it. And like I say, I'm working hard to do it. But it's. Uh, it, it's it's finding it very tough at the minute. Not quite the right time to, to do it. Not, no, not, not at the moment. It doesn't seem it. it doesn't yeah. seem it. I know Hampton have brought three players in, but I think they were free agents. Yeah. Um, it's one of those. The, the players that I've looked at and spoke about, uh, we thought, thought we might have had one on Monday. Um, there might be one available in a couple of weeks, but it, it, we've got to wait and see, and that, that one could be a good one. Mm -hmm. um, but it's a waiting game. Yeah. I've got to have trust and faith in them, even though I've had a go at them today in the change room and now. Because I'm the first one to back them, I'm the first one to look after them. But they can't put that performance on um, in the second half in an FA Cup game that means an awful lot. I haven't mentioned money to them, but that hurts because you need the money. Um, they can't do that. And I, and I won't stand by that. You know, you've got to back your players, and I do. I back them all day long. But when they, when they do that, it's, 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 it's not good enough. It's not good enough, and, and they don't deserve to be back. And they deserve the ones to be standing here, explaining what went wrong. Mm, mm. Um, yeah. Like you said, it was a nothing game, and two mistakes have cost us again. Mm, mm. Well, 
Uh, try and keep your head up, Steve, and we look forward, if we can, to Hampton. It'd be quite a game. It'd be a tough one, Jim, but yeah, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll be positive, don't worry. Thanks. Cheers, mate. Cheers. Okay, Jim. James, uh, obviously disappointed you today. Uh, talk, talk us through how we lost the game, or where do you think we lost it? Uh, very plain and simple, just lapses of concentration, mm -hmm. I guess, switching off. Uh, it's just a crazy sort of 10, 15 maybe minutes that cost us again. Uh -huh. um, it's just down to our own mistakes. And I don't think teams, even in the league as well, are, are having to work massively hard uh -huh. to, to score goals against us. Uh -huh. I think a lot of goals are coming from our undoing. And again, unfortunately, it showed today. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, with all due respect to his form, fair dues, they won the game, they're in the hat. But they didn't really look a great side first yeah. half, did they at all? No, no again, uh, we was definitely in control of the game. We felt we was in control of the game. I think they had, like, at the end of the first half, they had one like, cross mm. that right. obviously parts has headed out mm. in the last like, two minutes of the half. But did they really have, I don't even think they were just a yeah. shot in the first half. I think you're right. Um, yeah. And then again, it just goes to show they've had two shots in the second half and they mm. scored both of them. Mm. Um, oh yeah, and I mean the header at the back post that the guys missed that like, header. Oh, right. Yes. But again, <laughs> like, three good. shots they've yeah. scored two. Yeah. Uh, we've had a, we've had a few chances. Um, again, obviously our goals coming from a penalty. We need to start. I mean, it seems like we're having to work so hard it's against these teams yeah. to try yeah. and carve teams open or yeah. like again get penalties and and try to score goals. Um, yeah. But when it comes to other teams, it's like it's it's become our own, our own doing, and we've kind of let ourselves down, and we can't keep saying it, unlucky. Mm -hmm. uh, now it's got to come to a point where we all, as a collective, as a group, we've got to learn from that, mm -hmm. mentally be stronger, and say, "Listen, I'm not gonna let you score that easier." You know, mm -hmm. that kind of mentality. Mm -hmm. No, it must have been your 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 worst nightmare. I just think we got that man, Nicky Wheeler, uh, scores the goal or, or not the winner, but yeah. the equaliser. Again, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but we know what he can do, don't we? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> the, I mean, he he came on and, and you can see that he was up for it mm. straight away. When he, he's obviously one to him. He's probably got a point to prove. Yeah. yeah. To come in. I mean, he scored at their place. And, yeah. To score again, it, it's, it's a bit <laughs> it's a bit downing, but um, again, it like. Before that, in control, and then sure. we've lost the ball up in their half. Yes, a few things have happened after that. Mm. He's he's busted the gut to get down the left wing and mm. Mm. and get in and score. Um, mm. Mm. It's just it's just unfortunate. Again, yeah. it's not coming from teams massively carving us open. Mm. I think maybe as a team, as a collective, our shape was a bit poor at the time. As a collective, where the plays broken up down further up higher up the pitch. We've kind of, as a collective, lost our shape a bit, uh, lost our bearings, and allowed play players to run off us. And and he's off, ran Buster got from the halfway line, and obviously got got in and, and he's tucked it away. The old, the, old, the old chap can still do it, can't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see what he can do when he's in front of goal. Um, well, onwards and upwards, James. We go to, we go to Hampton hmm. uh, next Saturday. Um, that's going to be a tough one. As they're going, they're all they're all tough. They, aren't they? Yeah, I don't think any game. In this league will be mm. will be easy or you say yeah we're guaranteed or you mm. go like we're guaranteed to get three points and I don't even think you can go in any league with that mentality because on certain teams they just anyone could beat anyone I think uh, it's a massive game for us next Saturday um, they're, they're near the bottom yeah yeah mm. exactly mm. and and it's the old cliche it's a, a six point <laughs> perhaps know. not quite yeah. yet this part yeah. of the season but, 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 but I still I think in the sense that the fact that we would say that we've, we've played, what, 10, a quarter of the games mm -hmm. now, 10, 11 games in yeah, the league, yeah. you know, and you need to start registering points. We can't keep saying well, we, was, we played well, but we was unlucky. And, and yeah, f f obviously there's been a few games where the ref hasn't been great, but we can't keep saying, oh yeah, the ref has, because at the end of the day, we got to do what's right on the pitch as well, score our chances to defend better as a team, to stop them goals going in. So. Um, it got to come to a point where we need to start getting and registering them points and putting them points on the board and get this table where uh, sorry get this club where we feel we probably deserve to be because I don't again I don't feel we've gone into any game and we felt that any team has completely like taken us off the park and played us off the park and we've been in most of if not every game apart from barring one or two probably 
as a collective poor performances. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, if we go in, I mean, with the mentality like how we did, I mean, against your Concord, your Dartford, Weymouth, Bath yeah. away, if we put in one of those performances, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll we'll get some points on the board, and but we need to be consistent with it. Um, in this league, consistently, you have to be getting sevens, eights for good six, seven games. Obviously, there might come a point in the season where certain players, including myself, might not be on form. That's for the gaffer to realise that he changes it up. But then again, you still need seven of, set, I think, eight or nine of your eleven players on the pitch, giving seven out of seven out of tens minimum. And then if you if you got that, then you'll be you'll be all right. Definitely. Yeah. Well, thanks so much, Dave, yeah. for your honesty, James. Bad luck today. Cheers, thank you. Thanks. Thanks.